say good morning. It's that one. Yes, that one. That one. Yeah. They told me you have that 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 pink one. This is the back. Oh yeah, but the pink one's cow pole. This is um, this is the samba coal <coughs> hand. <coughs> Is much needed. Good? Delicious? Mm. I don't like it. <laughs> you loved it yesterday. Wow. Every day you're different. You're like, yesterday I love it, tomorrow I don't. Good morning everybody. Happy Thursday. I hope you're well. Uh, a bit of a slow paced morning. This morning. Yeah. Yeah, Miles got up about 5.30 and kind of got into bed for half an hour before getting up, which was quite nice. Um, but yeah, not really accomplished much apart from the standard chores, you know. It's been day today, so we've got stuff piled up, ready to go out. No, I'm not leaving alone. Yeah, as you can see, I'm not dressed. <laughs> I've done I'm the, the usual stuff. Hi, she ready? She dressed? Sorted myself out finally, like 10 to 9. I've just, I haven't really been in the mood and actually Alistair's been in a really bad mood this morning as well. He didn't, like he's usually the first one up, in the shower, dressed, sorted, like by 7, quarter past 7 at the latest, he's ready. He didn't even get out of bed till 20 past 7 this morning. He's just been in a foul mood. Um, but you know, we're entitled to a foul mood a day, Ooh, you know. Um, I feel exactly the same. Ooh. Miles in a better mood today, aren't we? It's been a little bit moish this morning. Kind of normal. But, um, are you reading it now? We're actually, where are we going today? I'm actually going to the whole thing. Yeah, I'm going to take him to a different one today. I'm going to take him to Enjoy, which is like interactive place. So they do like wall climbing, wall climbing, soft play. They've got trampolines. They've got an interactive room. They're doing the toddler morning. It's cheaper as well. So it's like £6.95 for like a two hour slot. So I think we're going to do the 9.30 till 12.30 um, because the other time slot is at 12.30 till 2.30 and obviously for me I need to get home and do a school run. So I'd first just get out early, get it done, even if we get an hour and a half in, it's fine. What are you eating? Um, so we'll probably get lunch out as a nice little treat. Careful. So yeah. That is, oh. sorry, you can't even see me. I actually put my hair in like a claw clip, which probably looks ridiculous because I've only got a tiny, minute ponytail, but I thought it was a bit better than just having a tiny, silly ponytail. Um, and I just feel like scraping it back because it's really boof on Pulled out the flip out and what's this one called? This one activated they all closed down all these jump trampoline places when you know years ago when we used to go they've all closed down now so but i've still got the socks so i don't have to buy any we had tiny ones for all supply so, i've got to show you my tiktok shop fake uggs honestly these are so nice if anything yes. like i've had uggs before over the years and the grips on these are so much better the sole is better like they are so so like comfy and they're only 33 pounds i believe that's including and postage look at my hips. well traveled and i actually went for my usual size which is a five and they fit really well so yeah and first time wearing them by the way i've had these before christmas i bought them ah uh, not mine yeah we've got your boots on but yeah comfy comfy outfit i've just got a leggings on with this sort of throw on thing which is from Matalan actually, and then my M&S coat. Didn't think to uh, put the cover on my, my screen last night, did I? Of course I didn't. Graham did school run this morning. So he was like, my car's already defrosted. I might as well take them. And I was like, all right, makes it so much easier. But um, yeah, so I've gone round with the de-icer. What's minus two today? Put some gloves on. I thought this hoodie's tall might actually come in useful. Graham got me this thing a little while ago, about a good year or so ago. Huh. I've got patience. It's not too bad. It's nearly there. It's nearly there. Ooh. 
Why does the back heater work so much better than the front? Like seriously. Go on then, dive in. Whee! <laughs> You wanna go find a slide? No? King of the castle! <laughs> Woo -hoo -hoo. Whoa, is that scary? Right, we've come to the big slide. We've not done this slide before, have we? Yeah. No. This is what it looks like. Ooh. Are you ready? Where do we put the money? Under my house. Go on then, put the money in. In there. In there, sorry, this one. That's it. Press go, green mum, green mum, on your foot, green foot. Yes. <laughs> oh my goodness. You can stop the feet. Nice. Right. We are back from Enjoy. We had a really good few hours there. It's now quarter past one. Um, Miles had a little power nap on the way home. I did actually pop to Decathlon after Enjoy because um, I'm doing one of the park runs, like a local one with my work on Saturday. And we're doing Red January, which is obviously for a mine charity. And in Decathlon, they have all the Red January stuff. So I wanted to get I didn't want to buy it online because I just have hassle with delivery and stuff. So these are $2.99 for one of the snuds. So I, want, I wanted to get one of those. And then I thought I'd get myself one of the kids' t-shirts as well. So the adults' ones are like $7.99. And then these ones, the kids' ones are down to $2.99. And this one, what size is it? 12 to 13. It's all right. I thought it'd fit me. Might be a bit snug. So I got that. Um, and then I also got some running gloves. No, this one is one thing that I actually really want because when I do venture out, oh yeah, it's got the touch things as well, so you can use your phone. Um, my hands get absolutely freezing, and these are kind of more like instead of like the fluffy normal gloves that you'd have, these are proper lycra yeah. ones, so you don't sweat. If that makes sense, yeah. And they get they get too hot and they're breathable, but they still keep your hands warm. And then one thing that I have been looking for, looking for, is a running vest. Although I don't specifically need it for short runs, I think for the summer and for like stretching my runs out longer, a running vest is really useful because you can put there's like a hydration pack in the pack in the back, and it's just got more pockets. And Decathlon, honestly, this is a really decent one. It's got loads of pockets. It's not overly bulky. There's a hydration pack in the back, as you can see, uh, five liter. It's got the straw and everything. <laughs> careful, careful. Um, and like I've looked on Amazon and they're so expensive. I don't know if it's just the hype of like maybe a lot of people just starting the new year with new runs. They're like 50 pounds. These, this is really, it looks like a really decent one. For 20 pounds, I thought it was pretty good. So I thought I'd grab it. I don't, it's not an essential that I need right now, but I think it would be useful for long runs. So I've got that. That's well. And then we brought home Miles' pizza and some chips because we had lunch there, but you know, I don't want to waste it. And they're, they're always really good at like, you can just grab a box and whatever, take it home. Oh my goodness, he's so emotional. Um, so as soon as I got to enjoy, I flipping, I'd say sprain my ankle, but I like, it's not a heavy, obviously I'm walking. I can feel it's bruised though and I, had to be really careful on the trampoline, but I literally rolled over on my ankle. And honestly, I don't think I've ever done that. I just, I don't know, but it, you know, when you hear like the crunch and I was just like, oh. So I was just kind of limping around and it does feel actually achy. I reckon I'm gonna have a bruise. I also broke a nail. Can you see that? 
That's my, they're my real nails. Like, I'm absolutely devastated. I've only had them done just over a week. So I'm going to have to file that down because it's, it's kind of catching. I actually know what to do for dinner tonight. I was going to do, like, quick things, like, use up some stuff for the freezer. But I'm working tomorrow afternoon, like, into, you know, like, I'll be home about 7-ish. So I think I might just do that because I get Graham to put it in the oven. And it's just, you know, it's kind of easy. <laughs> my nail looks ridiculous. Look at it. <laughs> Should look like that. Um, so, yeah, I might, I don't know. Graham's in the, in the cutting room today. I'm saying the meat room in the cutting room today. So he's packing up mints and making sausages. The sausages need to hang for at least one or two days. Before. It's okay. He's allowed my slippers. I've told you. So, I don't know. I think he might have some mints or something. Yeah, it's glorious. I've actually opened... The back door up because I just feel like where's Hen? Hello. Yeah. Um. I can't wait till summer. I'm already like itching. I just I can't wait just to enjoy the garden again, isn't it? And get the get the doors open and oh, get rid of this cold. Oh, oh dear. Glorious, isn't it, Miles? Hot chocolates outside and lick mats. Delicious. And cup of tea for mummy. Cup of tea. I've just finished hoovering the hard floor. It's just bits and bits obviously been in the garden. Um, Henry loves dry, crusty leaves, twigs. They're all coming in. Miles is having a meltdown. Um, not because he's he wanted, not because I told him to come in. He's just having a melt day, he's having a moment. I think we need a bit of quiet time. Um, I want to take it on. I'm not putting cricket on. I've just put the TV on because I know you need some quiet time. I'm going to put Peppa Pig on. I'm going to put Peppa Pig on. Yeah, so, right, go sit down and I'll get Peppa Pig on. So, yeah, Miles is. Um, Miles is actually breathe, you know? Right. I am... Um, I've just been using the trusty squirt mop thingy. I've had this for years and actually I on and off use it but honestly at the moment with a peeing puppy over hard floor it's been a godsend. It's got these reusable pads which I just, I use for one day and just wash it and then, you know, every day put a fresh pad on. It's so needed just to keep the floors clean and fresh. Um, and it's just quick, quick. But to be fair, it's not because he's peeing on the floor because actually he doesn't. He, he uses the pads, but occasionally he might miss a little bit, but it's kind of half on the pad, half on the floor. But also it's just, I don't know, it's just grimy. I've got one more load to do three loads to do today and actually I've decided what we're going to have for dinner because Graham actually brought back some yummy ribs from Lidl. There we go. Hoisin pork rib rack. Look how good. We used to actually buy some ribs from Aldi and I haven't bought them in ages and they were delicious. But um, yeah, so we're going to have those for dinner. Well, Miles has been, he's been playing with kinetic sand. Um, I've actually just been sorting out my part of pantry, my cupboard full of all the basics. I do my that's basically my baking shelf. Oh, so much out of date stuff, honestly. Um, but yeah, I've been through it. It's all organised now. Um, and then yeah, just organising this bit really. Just again getting rid of like really old lentils and out of date just stuff, you know. Just and it just shows me how much I just need to start using some of these bits while I've got them, you know. I've got them in these little chicken things, which are quite good. I like these Maggie ones because they're so easy. <gasps> Does the nozzle fit? Is it tight enough? TikTok find. <laughs> Not the gadget. Seven nine no actually nine ninety nine I think it was or seven ninety nine, something like that. And you just unscrew the piece from your I was like that will fit. And it fits. Well, I think it fits. Right. Yes. 
Okay, look at this. Ooh. Oh, it's so handy. See, when you've got a bigger sink, it's really hard to get into the corners. What does that one do? Ooh, like a jet. It's like pretty. No. I've got a good amount of washing to fold and put away, and it's Miles's, so I'm just going to do it in his room. Also has his um, sheets and stuff in there, so I'm just going to sort the bed out. I cannot be bothered, but I'm going to do it. I'm over today. You know, you're just like, I'm done. <laughs> I'm done. I'm over it. Um, yeah, when's bedtime? <laughs> I keep saying to myself, bedtime's coming round. It's not long. My ankle as well is absolutely throbbing and I'm supposed to be doing this 5k on Saturday. So that's going to be interesting. I'm going to be limping round, I reckon. I do for tonight. Are you making my bed? Yeah, I'm making your bed. Oh. Is that okay? Yeah, I'll lay Oh, you're tired, aren't you? Yeah. Nice bathies. Do you want to get your bath bomb out ready and put it in the bathroom? Which one are you going to pick? I don't think you've got many left, actually. No. I've got two more left. Two more? Is that it? Oh, no, you've got f three, five. Yeah. That's not bad. I've got this one, that one, that one. Not yet. No, I'll go bed later. Blanky. 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 Shut up, Blanky. I'll go bed later. Shut up, Blanky. I'll go bed later. Although I can't be bothered to like do this. And I, I just want to, I just don't want to do this. Obviously, I've got to cook dinner, tidy up again, bath bed, you know, the usual, the usual stuff. Okay? <laughs> um, but realistically, I think if I get these layers of washing done, then tomorrow I have got work in the afternoon, so I've got some time to myself in the morning and I'm actually not gonna do any washing and I'm not gonna put anything away, you know, you know what I mean? Like if I do it now, I don't have to think about it tomorrow. Hey. And hey. yeah, it just gives me some free time. Hey. When I do have hey. some like time on my own to actually just do nothing or do what I want, you know? Henry, so, my Henry, yeah. <laughs> Henry, right, stop getting emotional, honestly, he bring them back. Henry, Henry, come on. That's it, see, he's bringing them back, well done. Bringing the pants back, fantastic. Right, I've got my air fryer on, so I'm going to be doing, um, I just washed my red potatoes, I'm going to be doing wedges like thin wedges with this um, southern seasoning and some mayo in the air fry, 25 minutes, amazing. Off isn't it, mummy help. Oh yeah. Right, I'm gonna put this seasoning on. Okay, oh, oh my god. Okay, that's plenty. <laughs> yeah, wow. And that's how they look. And I find the mayo just makes them extra crispy. All right, I'm gonna get these ribs out. Good job. Mm. Um, I don't think we've had the hoisin ones. I think they're usually sticky barbecue. So not a ton of meat. Obviously there is five of us. I don't know how well they're actually gonna go around. Surprising. We do Easy. eat a lot of meat. And well, you know, I think Graham could probably <laughs> want to do it on his own, you know what I mean? <laughs> Okay, that's how the ribs turned out. Basically giving half to the boys because they just eat so much more meat. Um, so yeah, they pretty much got us Alistair's, that's Graham's, they've pretty much got the same portion. That's mine, me and Vi pretty much have the same. But I've got more veggies and potatoes and then Miles has this little, the end rack. But it looks really good. I just think next time I'll probably get three Right, second load of washing to fold. I've got the last one in tumble dryer. I have just cleaned up the messes. Um, that's just soaking. Fed the puppy, fed the dogs. Guess what I'm doing? I'm doing another round of hot chocolates. No one's obviously had hot chocolate today, but everybody wants a hot chocky, so. Yeah, and I thought, this is a massive one. Um, it's just run out, but thankfully I had a backup. But yeah, Miles is in bed. But yeah, we're gonna wind down, hang out. I don't know what we're gonna do. What we're gonna watch? We might watch um, Barney and Bradley. Bradley and Barney. 
I love that. Just it's a good giggle, you know. I think there's a new series out on that, so we might watch that. Mm. Cozy, cozy, cozy. Look at him. Big fuss spot, aren't you? Oh, it's cozy time. What are you? <laughs> That's absolutely hilarious. You're hilarious. Um, it's getting a bit crazy now. Brand new Braddy and Barney Walsh. <laughs>